Good morning, afternoon, evening race fans. Harold Finch here with Slingshot 360 Diecast Racing. It's tournament time. The rules are simple. Switch lanes every race. Prelims, quarters, and semifinals. Best of three series. Best of seven series for the finals. And a restart if neither car crosses the finish line. Okay, let's race. First up, we have John Smith and the Rip Rod versus James West in the 69 pickup. Clean start into turn one. Pickup truck extending the lead into turn two and into turn three, getting a little sideways. Having some trouble in turn three, flips over. And here comes Rip Rod for the win. One nothing. Clean start for race two. Pickup truck. Gaining speed into turn two. Picking up more speed into turn three. No problems this time. Extending his lead right down the middle. One to one. Final lap. Clean into turn one. Wow, they're tight. Going into turn two. Pickup truck has a slight lead. Looks like he's maintaining that lead. Turn three. Not giving it up. And it's James West that advances into round two. Next up, we have Richard Noggin in the Pedal de Metal versus Brian Dykema in the Indy 500 Oval. Clean start into turn one. Pedal de Metal slams on the accelerator, extends a commanding lead out of turn two. Continues to extend that lead into turn three right down the middle. One nothing. Pedal de Metal. Clean into turn one. Pedal to metal really accelerating into turn two. A little bit of a bobble, but still maintaining a commanding lead into turn three. Still clean. And Richard Noggin advances into round two with a clean sweep. Next up, we have Derek Yance driving the 69 Chevelle versus Mark Grable driving the Nerve Hammer. Clean start into turn one. The Chevelle is pulling away as we go into turn two with a high turn out of turn two. Still strong in turn three, still picking up speed. One nothing Chevelle. Same start. Chevelle picking up speed again out of turn two. And oh, we've lost Nerve Hammer. We have lost Nerve Hammer. It is a Chevelle's race to lose. He cruises in. And Derek Yance is on his way to round two. Let's see where that nerve... Oh, there it is. Next up, we have Chris Reynolds driving the Formula Solar car versus Jeremy Wolf driving the Formula E Gen 2 car. And they're off into turn two. Solar's taking a lead. And it does a 180 out of turn two, <laughs> staring at his competition, going backwards into turn three. Oh, starting to lose that lead. Let's see. Can he hold on? Yes, he does. One nothing. Another clean start. Solar takes the lead, extending that lead. Goes high in turn two, stays going forward. No 180 this time. Into turn three, solid, and into round two. Next up, we have Curtis Schultz driving the 84 Pontiac Firebird and Kevin Bowarski driving that 52 Hudson Hornet. Clean start, and ooh, that Firebird is taking off a commanding lead coming out of turn two, and oh no! Hits a guardrail and flies off, and all the Hudson has to do is cruise into the finish line for win number one, and that's exactly what he does. Second race starts out clean. Firebird off to another strong lead. Turn two, looks good. Picking up speed. Turn three, still looking good. No problems. Tied up. Clean start into turn one. Uh, some control issues. Does a 360 the Firebird does out of turn one. Going into turn two, it's pretty tight because of that. Now he's picking up speed. Going into turn three, uh, having some more control issues, losing control, and is off the track. And the Hudson will waltz in for the finish and into round two. Next up, we have John Anderson driving the 65 Ford Galaxy 
and Addison Tanner driving the Twin Mill Gen E. Clean start into turn one. Twin Mill picking up some more speed as the Galaxy wobbles. Out of turn two, a commanding lead. Going into turn three, uh, getting sideways, slowing down. Not at the finish line yet, but just makes it. Clean start for race two. Twin Mill off to an early lead, extending that lead. Uh, Galaxy catching up into turn three. This is tight. Uh, Twin Mill gets sideways and stops the show. Restart. Restart of the second race. Twin Mill's off to an early lead again. Galaxy catching up, and they are neck and neck out of turn two. Twin Mill picks up speed into turn three. Does a 180 backwards into round two. And I think we lost Galaxy somewhere. Yes, we did. Next up, we have Caleb Irvine driving that mod rod and Michael Martello driving the eight crate station wagon. Another clean start. Mod rod off to an early lead. Creating a little bit of a gap into turn two. Does a 180. Still has the lead, but eight crate catching up. Trying to make a pass. Mod rod has it. And mod rod takes off right from the start. Commanding lead into turn two, clean line, no slowing down, into turn three, and on into round two. In our final preliminary round, we have Tim Kastner driving the Volvo 850 Estate and Juan Cobracalde driving the Roger Dodger. And they're clean into turn one. Roger Dodger picking up a lead, having some control issues into turn two as the Volvo catches up, gives him a little bump. Going into turn three, the Volvo's right on his heels. Roger Dodger still has the lead, but now is swerving left, swerving right, and losing speed each time. Does he realize the station wagon is right on his tail? And the station wagon takes it! Wow! Station wagon, the Volvo, one nothing. Wow. Clean start into turn one, and Roger Dodger again takes the lead. No wavering this time. Clean out of turn two, picking up more speed. Out of turn three, and he means business. Ties it up. One to one. Sudden death. Both cars look good into turn one. Roger Dodger increases the lead going into turn two. And increases further going into turn three. Slight drift but waltzes into round two. And here are your quarterfinalists. James West in the 69 Chevy pickup will go against Richard Noggin in the pedal to metal. Derek Younce in the 69 Chevelle will go against Chris Reynolds in the Formula Solar. Kevin Boarski in the 52 Hudson Hornet will go against Addison Tanner in the Twin Mill Gen E. And Caleb Irvine in the Mod Rod will go against Juan Coricalde in the Roger Dodger. Fast out of the gate. Pedal to metal is first to turn one. Has a lead, but that pickup truck comes up, rams him into turn two. Pedal to metal picks up again into turn three. Still has that lead, but the pickup truck is trying to pass on the right. Oh, gets cut off, and pedal to metal comes through. Pedal to metal again has a lead into turn one. That pickup truck again rams him into turn two. Pedal to metal gets sideways. Then straightens out, picks up some speed, creates some distance, but gets sideways again, going into turn three. Uh, the truck gets caught up with him this time, and, oh, they're both stuck. Clean start into turn one. Pickup truck is on his tail, rams him into a 180, and, and then gets stuck at turn two. It is all pedal to metal to just cruise in into the semifinals. The, the Next up, Chevelle and Formula Solar, and the Solar is off to a lead. Chevelle catching up, coming into turn two, and oh, we lost a Chevelle on turn two. It is all Formula Solar. One nothing. Race two, and we have the Solar coming out of turn one. Chevelle's right on his tail, going into turn two, giving him a bump. Uh, Solar picks up a little bit of speed. Oh, gets sideways. Chevelle comes back again. Can he make a turn? Oh, no. Chevelle wipes out, and it's the Solar. Comes through to take it off to the semifinals. 
Strong start for Twin Mill into turn one. Increasing the lead. Hudson trying to catch up high in turn two. Hits the rear, spins around on its back. Can the Hudson take advantage? All he has to do is cruise in for the win. But no, he takes the wrong line. Instead of a sure victory, it turns into a restart. Oh, no. Out of the gate, Twin Mill again takes a commanding lead. Smooth line this time out of turn two. No wavering. Turn three, I think she means business. Never a doubt. And a little bump for good measure. Final heat. Twin Mill off to a commanding lead. Not relinquishing at all. Little bit of a slide coming into the finish line. And there. We've got Mod Rod and Roger Dodger. And Mod Rod is flying around these curves with authority. Coming in for the victory. Clean start into turn one. Mod Rod extending the lead already. Turn two, turn three, and it is all Mod Rod all the time. And we have our final four. Richard Noggin in the Pedal to Metal will go against Chris Reynolds in the Formula Solar. And Addison Tanner in the Twin Mill Gin will go against Caleb Burvine in that Mod Rod. Both cars strong into turn one. Solar's got a slight lead into turn two. Gets sideways. Pedal to Metal is catching up. They're both tangled up into turn three. But Solar has a lead out of turn three. Coming towards the finish line. And it is Solar. Both cars strong into turn one. Formula has a slight lead out of turn two. Pedal to Metal catches Formula Solar in turn three, but Formula Solar steps on the accelerator and into the final. Strong start by both cars, neck and neck into turn one. Going into turn two, Mod Rod does an okie doke and steps on the accelerator, leaving Twin Mills in the dust for the win. Both cars take off strong. But it's all Mod Rod taking the lead and never look back. It is Mod Rod into the finals. And here are your finalists. Chris Reynolds in the Formula Solar. Kayla Burvine in the Mod Rod. This will be a best of seven. Both cars are strong going into turn one. Neck and neck. Mod Rod has a slight lead going into turn two but is wavering a bit. Formula Solar catches up and passes. Going into turn three, I don't think I don't think Mod Rod's gonna catch him. No, it's Formula Solar for the win and one to nothing. Both cars flying into turn one, but Mod Rod takes off out of turn two and turn three. Camera can't even keep up with him. Ties it up one to one. Strong out of the gates. Formula Solar has the early lead, but gets sideways. Mod Rod trying to push through. Solar won't let him. Solar keeps the lead going into turn three. This time, Mod Rod pushes him off the track. And on to the victory. Two to one. Both cars strong into turn one. Mod Rod with the lead into turn two. And we have lost Formula Solar in turn two. It is all Mod Rod. Three to one. There he is. Strong start for both cars. And Formula Solar actually has the lead with Mod Rod right on his tail into turn two. Mod Rod still on his tail. Formula gets sideways, then knocks Mod Rod out off the track at turn three in for the victory. Both cars strong out of the gate, but this time Mod Rod takes the lead going into turn two. Right down the middle. Increasing his lead. And... Cruises for the victory and the tournament win, 4-2. to two. Congratulations to Caleb Irvine and the Mod Rod in my first ever tournament. Thank you all for all of your participation. I hope you enjoyed watching this video. This has been a Slingshot 360 Diecast Racing production. Thanks for watching.